The Canadian pork industry learned many years ago that if they want to consistently produce and deliver high quality pork to the most demanding markets in the world, they would have to work together. So both our producers and our meat packers work together on a total quality assurance system, which is an on-farm delivery system that combines genetics, feed, nutrition, animal care and transportation to produce that animal in the best possible environment. The Canada is blessed with a large land base and we grow a lot of our own grains here so we have a good supply of constant grain available. Nutritionally, we have made great advancements in the way we feed our, our livestock, our pork today, which improves both feed conversion on pork for the farmer's bottom line and the quality and the taste uh, of the pork that comes to the consumer on their plate. We produce high quality meat, it's to have the most modern genetics available. We do that in a way we bring it in with AI, artificial insemination. Uh, it's very important that all things work together to produce that healthy hog, to produce that quality pork uh, cut that we all want to eat as consumers. It's our goal to produce the best quality pork in the world possible. We definitely keep stressing it and keep practicing it to handle these animals as quiet and as relaxed as possible. It is our goal to do that because we know that it impacts meat quality. It's the stress level of the hogs is very, very uh, important. Uh, if you handle the hogs very carefully, it's less stress on the hogs too. I enjoy eating pork and I like to see everybody handle the pork in a good manner. We want to have the best quality as possible. So when we receive them, we do it as in a quiet mode as much as possible. We will shower them, let them calm down to lower down their temperature. Bringing meat down to the right temperature stabilizes it. That helps in keeping that firmness and color of the pork. That reduction will allow the pH to reduce as slow as possible to get a better meat quality. About 50% of the quality attributes are farm related and about 50% of them are process related. So if you can get the heat out of the pig faster, that helps in keeping that firmness and color of the pork. We grade for color, we grade for size, we grade for firmness uh, and other attributes that a customer might ask us to grade for. Premium quality pork is a very competitive business. Our best customers in the very best markets are looking for five key attributes that determine the performance of the meat. That includes meat color, fat color, marbling, firmness, and water holding capacity. Combined, these five attributes deliver the product performance that our end user customers are looking for. Meat color refers to the pigment of the muscle, and not just the whole muscle, but also the cut surface of the muscle. Fat color is also a very important attribute. Customers are looking for white, firm, and hard fat. Marbling is a very important attribute. This is the intramuscular fat. It delivers the flavor and the taste of the meat, and not just the rib end. Our customers also look at the marbling at the leg end. So you need to be able to produce a product that has a consistent marbling score throughout the muscle. Firmness is also a very important attribute. Customers are looking for firm meat that will hold up while it's being sliced. This improves the yield and improves the ability of the meat to deliver the flavor that the customer is looking for. The last attribute is water holding capacity. Water holding capacity affects the flavor and the yield of the finished product. Premium quality pork is very versatile for the end user. This allows the end user to produce many, many different products from one primal cut. This is when the meat quality attributes all come together, when the product is slow roasted and all the savory flavors come out, the product is cooked to the right temperature. That's really when you see how high quality pork can perform. It's perfect.